Hello, my name is Kalyani. Welcome to Release 13 Bill Management Training. In this session, we will talk about what's coming in bill management. For the enhancements covered in this training, we'll give an overview followed by more details to explain how you can use them and what business value they bring. Then we'll walk you through a demonstration. Next, we'll explain what you need to consider before enabling these features in your business and what you need to know to set them up. Oracle Bill Management Cloud is an electronic bill presentment solution that allows organization to reduce the cost of billing and collections. The solution provides self-service customer-led bill management process. It provides easy to use user experience with real-time account review, dispute monitoring, and online payments that are instantly reflected on the customer account. The resulting business process efficiency improvements increase customer satisfaction and deliver cost reductions by streamlining the overall accounts receivable operation. Key features of bill management allows your customers to register customers, analyze open and closed transactions, download transactions, manage payment options, and monitor disputes. Collections or receivables personnel register their customers to enable them to leverage bill management for review and payment of outstanding receivables transactions in a self-service manner. They can register already identified customer contacts with an email address. When the user registration is completed, a notification is sent to the customer contact welcoming him or her to bill management and providing the username and the URL to access bill management portal. An additional notification is also sent providing the link to set their password to access the environment. It is possible to register one user for multiple accounts. User can also unregister the external contact for one account at a time. External users can review the account balance by aging bucket, outstanding credit memos, and dispute transactions in one or more accounts. They can filter the transaction by currency and account number. The external user can search transactions by transaction number, type, and purchase order number. They can pay transactions one at a time or group them together by currency. Payments can be made using a new or an existing credit card or through a bank account. External users can also request credit for a particular transaction. User can review activities such as payment, dispute and adjustments on a transaction. User can print a specific transaction by selecting the same. Only printed transactions which are already delivered to the customer are visible in bill management. Payment can be made by combining one or more transactions that belong to the same account and in the same currency. Payments can be made in full or for a partial amount. Credit card payments require tokenization to be enabled in Oracle Fusion payments. User can raise a request for credit by choosing to dispute specific sections of the invoice for an amount or percent value. Using transaction history, users can review partially or fully paid transactions for a single account or for all accounts they are registered with. Transactions can be filtered by transaction date, due date, or apply date. The user could also review all the receipt numbers applied against the transaction. The period of transaction history presented is defined by the period specified in the Manage Bill Management System options. The sales and marketing teams can be granted with internal bill management role to provide limited access to view customer transaction information. They are allowed to review only one account at a time. An internal user can review activities such as payments, disputes, and adjustments on the transaction page. 
similar to the external flow, only printed transactions which are delivered to the customer are visible in bill management. An internal bill management user is not allowed to make payments unless explicitly provisioned for. What are the business values that bill management provides? Improves cash flow. Customers can review and pay invoices immediately. It helps reduce expenses related to printing and mailing invoices, decreases incoming invoice inquiries to your receivables department, freeing them up for other value added tasks, reduces or eliminates the need to reconcile open transactions between the payables department and your receivables department. It improves customer satisfaction by providing real-time visibility of customer statements. Real-time dispute processing enables customers to quickly resolve issues that may arise regarding the customer invoice process, all of which leads to increased ROI and decreased DSO. The other benefits also includes that it can be used by a casual internal user who does not need access to receivables. As the bill management solution is a set of intuitive UIs that do not require extra training, any salesperson, for example, can review a customer's account prior to visiting the customer and have full visibility to any issues regarding payment or billing prior to the visit. Now let's go to a demo of bill management that will show you how these enhancements can be used by your business. I'm currently logging in as the internal user customer account billing inquiry. From the home page, click bill management. I optionally provide the business unit and enter the customer or the customer account number whose account review is to be performed. The account overview page helps me review the open transactions for the chosen customer account and business unit. I can select the currency for which I want the transactions to be filtered. Click on each of the info tile to see the data being presented. The invoices info tile will display the count of all open invoice transaction for the customer account or the sum of invoice value in the specific currency. The credit memo info tile displays the count of all open credit memo transactions for the customer account or the sum of credit memo value in the specific currency. And the in dispute info tile displays the count or sum of invoices having the disputes pending approval. Click on a specific transaction number. I can see the invoice print image being presented in a complete manner. On clicking the print button, the invoice image can be submitted for printing. By clicking the transaction history button, I can review and filter historical transactions to find details of when a particular transaction was fully or partially paid along with the receipt numbers by which they were paid. A customer contact has been registered to access bill management to review and pay outstanding receivable transactions in a self-service manner. The external customer contact, Mr. Jeffrey Winkler, logs in to review the customer accounts for which he has access to. The external user can view the account overview page to gain an overview of the open transactions for review and action by him. He can easily sort and reorder them based on due or transaction dates, as well as identify subset of specific transactions based on key transaction attributes like transaction number and purchase order number. Click on the total info tile. The total info tile lists the sum of open transaction value for the currency chosen. In a similar manner, clicking on the other info tiles will present different data. The invoices info tile will display the count of all open invoice transaction or the sum of invoice value for the customer account in a specific currency. The credit memo info tile displays the count of all open credit memo transaction or the sum of credit memo value for the customer account in the specific currency. The in dispute info tile 
displays the count or sum of invoices having their disputes pending approval. The external user can click a specific transaction number and can see the invoice print image being presented in a complete manner. On clicking the print button, the invoice image can be submitted for printing. By clicking on the pay button, the external user can make a payment through a bank account transfer from a new or an existing customer bank account and specifying the payment amount. They also have the option of making a payment using a new or an existing credit card. Click on a specific transaction and click on request credit. The external user, if authorized, can raise a dispute against a particular invoice. They need to provide the dispute section details and the dispute reason to submit the dispute for approval. In this implementation advice section, we will go through what you need to consider before enabling these features in your business and what you need to know to set them up. This table depicts key upgrade information for the new features covered in this training. The feature is not automatically available after upgrade. You need to follow the setup steps mentioned in the next few slides to enable the feature. This feature is included with the shipped job roles customer account billing inquiry and customer accounts payable specialist. Identify account payables contacts to be assigned with external user access. Get the contact email address added to the customer account. If the customer is allowed to make credit card payments in bill management, ensure tokenization support is enabled. The setup for bill management is performed by a functional setup manager. There are two setup tasks, manage bill management registration and manage bill management system options. The first setup that you need to do is to enable the bill management feature. Follow these steps. Navigate to the setup and maintenance work area. Search for the setup task Manage Standard Lookups. On the Manage Standard Lookups page, search for the lookup type ARB underscore features. Add a lookup code Bill underscore Management to the ARB underscore features lookup type and save the changes. Next, we go to setting up the Bill Management System options. Follow these steps. Navigate to the Setup and Maintenance work area. Search for the task Manage Bill Management System Options. On the Manage Bill Management System Options page, set Role Assignment for External User field with the seeded role Customer Accounts Payable Specialist or any other customer role created. Change the transaction history period in months if required. It is recommended to set the value to 24 months. Set the aging method to be used to show the invoice bucket lines in the account summary infotile. For bank account payments, set the maximum future payment days allowed. The next setup that you need to do is to register the bill management external users using Manage Bill Management Registration. Please follow the below steps. Navigate to the Setup and Maintenance work area. Search for the setup task Manage Bill Management Registration. Search for the account whose contact needs to be registered. Select the account contact email address and click the Register button. A username will be created for the external user and emails will be sent to access the application. External user will receive an email with Oracle Fusion Applications welcome email subject requiring the user to set up their own password. Another email having welcome to bill management as the subject will have the URL link to access the application. Based on their implementation, external user should use this URL link to access the application. A self-service role will be added to the account contact.
This table details the shipped job roles that will access the new capabilities covered in this training. The business processes associated with the new capabilities covered in this training are detailed here. The high level business process is order fulfillment, manage customer bill with the activity register for bill management. This concludes this presentation. Thank you for listening. You can easily pause and rewind any of these slides if you require additional time to take in the detail.